it's really interesting that um this is the camera section it shrunk and there's no cameras on display any longer at office depot it's very very interesting it's a telling sign that um the hand handheld point and shoot um industry is just vaporizing oh well i was hoping to find a ring light sometimes you never know like you never know what kind of um surprising accessories you'll find in stores like these you know they might have some kind of odd accessory anyways i i thought it was um I thought that was really telling that there's no more um, point and shoot accessories. I mean, point and shoots on display. Oh well. Alrighty. 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 Time to go into the cubby hole. I was looking for shipping supplies. To my shock, a six by nine envelope, which would fit, say, maybe a DVD, was four ninety two or something like that. It was only like five envelopes. It, it was almost a dollar per envelope. Now I just purchased one hundred fifty envelopes at Costco of the same size. For 15 bucks so that works out to geez, a penny an envelope okay so 15 bucks holy moly 150 envelopes for 50 no no 10 cents an envelope yeah holy moly 10 cents an envelope versus 15 cents an envelope I mean a dollar an envelope 10 times markup so I'm looking for something uh, more reasonable still looking um, oh actually I should go to Fisher I'm trying to look for packaging supplies um, I was thinking of just ordering it online already you know yeah actually a private road although it's available to the public it's great that they added this cut through to make life easier yeah I drive I drive crooked come on so it's really interesting that the point shoots are disappearing and you know as I dug through my storage um, I found a point and shoot. I found my Kodak V570. As in, um, I bought eight of them. And um, I broke a whole bunch of them. No, no, here's, here's how you'll ruin your camera real fast. If you charge your camera next to one of those, um, you know those APCs, the UPS things? It's like about, it's pretty big. It has a battery in it. You have a battery backup. Okay, if you charge your camera next to it or on top of it, um, somehow it will just ruin the circuitry. There's like some transformer in there or whatever it is giving off emissions that will just wreck your camera. And then you'll get the, you'll get the um, unrecognized format error on your, on your camera. And that's it. And um, sometimes the camera will work, sometimes it won't. Sometimes it'll um, it'll just reset every time you change the battery out. Um, I remember I specifically I ruined a perfectly brand new camera. I was so pissed off because I thought that was my very last Kodak V570. So I'm making this video log because I I found this v, I found a brand new V570 and and I was like yeah man this is it. Um, the only problem was I couldn't find batteries, so I had to go order some new ones. Um, so, anyways, this is my this is a new new video blog using my new camera. 
Um, I still left the plastic on. I, I want to see the. I want to see how long that will last before it deteriorates and falls off. <clears throat> um, so yeah, okay. So let's 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 give an update on, on Robert here. Let me restart this video.